guys, welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, welcome. So today I just want to do a little bit more of a relaxed out video. Just sit down and chat with you guys and share with you some affordable, budget-friendly gift ideas. I am somebody I do not like to spend a lot of money at Christmas time. I pretty much always set a budget for myself and I stay within that budget. With everything that's going on in the world, I thought this would be a great idea to share with you guys some affordable, budget-friendly gifts. I do want to say one thing though before we get into the video and that's if you're stressing this year about money or being able to buy gifts for your family or friends only being able to afford one gift I think the best gift this year honestly is to spend quality time with each other really just show each other love I think your family would much rather that than to have you stress over gifts and money and all that so just know that you're not alone there's a lot of people this year that are feeling the exact same way so yeah I just wanted to go ahead and say that if you can't afford to give somebody a gift this year that is totally okay that's totally fine but if you are looking for some ideas I hope this video helps you so sit down relax grab a snack grab a drink and let's get right into the video. Okay, so I wrote everything down on my phone here just so I wouldn't forget. So the first thing I wanna talk about is mugs. Clearly I love mugs. Honestly, who doesn't love mugs though? I think mugs are such a great gift option, especially if you're not really sure what to give somebody. And it can also kind of work for like anybody in your life as well. Your parents, your aunt, your sister, a friend. You can also kind of personalize it to them as well. So, you know, say if they're into sports, you can get them their favorite team. You know, if they like animals, get them a mug with a dog on it. And honestly guys, one of the best places to get mugs is the dollar store that's pretty much where I get all my mugs they're super cheap they're pretty great quality and sometimes you can even get brand names there as well also I know lately a lot of people have been loving those like double walled mugs those have been super trendy they've been pretty much everywhere and I think one of the best places to get those would be like winners or marshalls I've seen packs of two and three for like less than $15 all right the next one I want to talk about is candles and I think again kind of like the mugs candles can kind of work for pretty much anybody I mean who doesn't love a nice smelling candle I think obviously one of the most popular spots for getting candles is Bath and Body Works. I know coming up they're gonna have their, I think they call it like candle day, where their candles are around like $9 each. I love Bath and Body Works. I think their candles are amazing, but their prices are insane. So I pretty much only buy them on sale days. So Black Friday, Cyber Monday, like I said, candle day. And they also have their semi-annual sale as well. I gotta say though, around the holidays, they pretty much always have sales. So definitely check them out. Also another great store for buying candles is again, the dollar store. That's pretty much where I get all my candles. Like every candle in my room right now is from the dollar store they smell great they have a great throw to them I, I would even honestly compare them to Bath and Body Works I've talked about this brand before if you've seen any of my dollar store hauls and you'll know that I love this brand but look out for the brand Watson's candles their candles are amazing they're super cheap they have them for like a dollar fifty right up to four dollars I believe I'm also gonna try to link as much as possible down below so if you're looking for any of these products definitely check the description this next one is kind of basic but I think it's a really great option and that would be gift cards now you definitely don't have to go out and spend fifty to 100 bucks on a gift card at all I think even like 10 to 25 bucks on like a Starbucks card or a Tim Hortons card would be such a great gift honestly and let me know if you guys think the same way as well but I think the best gifts are actually the most practical ones and I think a gift card is super practical say if it was a Tim Hortons gift card I would use that every single day <laughs> getting my iced coffee and I think a lot of us would especially you know on the way to work who would not love that? Okay, the next gift is books. Now, I think this would be such an awesome gift, especially if you do have a bookworm in your life. I think one of the best places to get affordable books is actually the thrift store. A lot of the time, you can get them for like buy one, get one. That is honestly the only place that I will buy my books. I just bought one not too long ago for three bucks. You can honestly get like three, four or five books for the price of one at Chapters. Such a great deal. So if somebody does ask for a book, I would definitely check your local thrift store before going anywhere else. My next gift is kind of a broad one, but it would be skincare. Now, I think a lot of the time when people think of skincare, they kind of think more on the expensive side of things, but there's actually a lot of skincare options that are super, super cheap. Chances are, if you have kids, they probably have TikTok, and skincare has been super trendy on TikTok lately, but the best thing about that is everything that's kind of trendy is super, super cheap. And I can tell you right now that those products are definitely gonna be popping up on a lot of Christmas lists this year. I think pretty much every single product is like less than $15. So the CeraVe one, there's also the Cetaphil, um, there's another one that I can't think of the name of right now. I think it's the Inky List, and I believe that one is only sold at Sephora. I could be wrong there. Okay, the next gift is gonna be socks slash slippers. Now, a lot of you are probably thinking, really, socks as a Christmas gift? Do we really want that for Christmas? Yes, we do. Again, I think it's such a practical gift. It's so winter time, obviously you wanna keep your feet warm. Why not have a nice cozy pair of socks? I'm gonna tell you right now, guys, do not buy your socks or your slippers anywhere else besides the dollar store. The dollar store has the best socks. I don't know what it is about them, 
but they have the best socks. Not only are they cute and cozy, but they're really great quality as well. And a lot of the time as well, you can get like a pack of them for four bucks, which is super great. If you watched my previous video, I did a video on the FabFitFun. I got some Muck Lux slippers in there. They have the same exact slippers at the dollar store for four dollars. Same exact one. The next one I want to talk about kind of goes along with socks and slippers, I think, and that would be pajamas or like a pajama set. I'm not going to lie, sometimes I find pajamas can be a little bit pricey, even at Walmart sometimes, but the best thing about coming into the holidays now is they normally always have sales on pajamas. So you can get like a set of them for probably $20 or under. If you are Canadian, I know another great spot to get pajamas is Ardeen. They always have great sales as well. If you're American, I would definitely check out like Forever 21 or even like Target. Pajamas are a great gift. I think since pretty much all of us have been kind of staying inside and not really going out too much, who wouldn't want to be comfy cozy in a new pair of pajamas? Another gift idea would actually be gift sets. Now you can get these a lot of the time at Walmart for such a great price. You can get like a shaving kit set, you can get like a certain brand with a bunch of their different products in it, you know, like a bath set, lotion, um, makeup, anything like that. I think personally the shaving kit sets are such a great deal. Sometimes just the razor in there alone is worth more than the actual set itself. Okay, this next one is a little bit specific and it's going to be for the makeup lovers in your life. So that would be the Wet n Wild liquid lipsticks. I own probably like five of them and I think they're one of the best products you can buy from the drugstore makeup wise. Whenever I wear them, I always get compliments on them. And on the Wet n Wild website right now, they're doing a huge sale and they have them for like $2.97 each, which is such a great price. So I really recommend recommend picking those up. Like I said, if you do have a makeup lover in your life, I think they would absolutely love those. So I have like three other makeup products, so I think I'm just going to go through those super quick. So the next one is actually another Wet n Wild product, and that would be their Loose Highlighter. So again, this is another product that I own, and again, whenever I wear it, I get tons of compliments. I always get people asking, what is that highlight? Where is it from? Where can I get it? It's super cheap. I think it was around like six or seven bucks. You can get it at Walmart, drugstores, Target. Again, like I said, the Wet n Wild website, they may have sale on that as well. I'm not really sure, but definitely check it out. Also, I gotta say, Wet n Wild is a great brand. If you're looking for something that's super cheap, Definitely check them out because their products are amazing. Okay, the next makeup product that I want to talk about is e.l.f. Cosmetics Lashes. E.l.f. is another one kind of like Wet n Wild, so their products are really cheap, but they're really great quality. Lashes can be super pricey. I've seen some going for like 20, 30, even $50, which is nuts. The great thing about the e.l.f. ones though is that they're around $7, super great price. They last for such a long time. So yeah, I think anybody that loves makeup would love getting a pair of those. Like I said about Wet n Wild, definitely check out the brand e.l.f. if you just want to look for makeup in general because they're amazing. Okay, so I believe this is my last makeup related product and that would be a makeup brush set. I definitely don't recommend going to Sephora and getting them because the prices are just nuts and I personally have Sephora brushes and I don't like them at all and I paid like $20 for a single brush which is just crazy. The best place in my opinion to get makeup brushes is actually Amazon. This is definitely going to be one of the products that I link down below. I'll probably link a couple down below just so you can check them out. I think this would be such an awesome gift especially if somebody's just kind of getting into makeup. I think they would absolutely love this. Okay my next gift idea is actually another one that you can get on Amazon and that would be a ring light. If you have somebody in your life that wants to get into maybe doing YouTube or step up their picture game or anything like that, I think they would really love getting a ring light. Filming equipment and camera equipment can be so pricey it's insane especially if you go to stores like Best Buy or even Walmart. I've seen numerous ring lights on Amazon for like $20 and under. Again this is going to be another product that I definitely link down below so check down there if you're looking for that. So the next gift idea is baked goods. Now this one's a pretty simple easy one to do especially if you have some in your life that has a sweet tooth you can go ahead and make them their favorite dessert whether that be cookies, cake, muffins, anything like that and you can go ahead and kind of put it in like a really cute tin. I've seen the cutest tins at the dollar store and that was the first idea that popped in my head. I was like, oh my gosh, how nice would that be to put like some cupcakes in there or something like that and maybe like a little note. So the next gift idea is bath bombs and I think one of the most obvious places to get bath bombs is Lush and I gotta say I think the prices at Lush are pretty reasonable. They're pretty good and one of the best things if you do want to get a Lush bath bomb but you can't physically go in store, they do have an online store where they carry all their products. I feel like I keep mentioning these two stores constantly but honestly I feel like they do have the best deals. Walmart and Dollar Store carry bath bombs as well and sometimes you can even get them in like little sets. Next one I want to talk about, I'm not sure of the exact name, but I believe it's called like a perfume sampler box. Now I know you can get these from shoppers where it's basically a bunch of like mini sized perfumes, but they're all kind of like brand name expensive perfumes, but for such a great price. And I think this is a really cool gift if you're not really sure what to get somebody or you know they like perfume or cologne, but just not really sure of the scent, you can get them the sampler box and they can pick out whatever scent they want. And sometimes as well, I don't know if this is with every box, but it'll come with a coupon inside. So when the person does find 
find a scent they really like and if they want to buy the full size of that they can end up getting money off the perfume okay the next gift idea is a comfy robe and let's be honest here who doesn't like a nice cozy robe Everybody loves robes. So I think robes can be a little pricey sometimes, but I think one of the best places to get robes, especially around this time of year, is Walmart. The prices are pretty good. They always kind of have deals around the holidays. So I think that's one of the best places to get robes. Also, Ardeen, um, Target, Forever 21. Winners and Marshalls actually too has really good prices as well. I, I think typically their prices kind of range from like 35 bucks down to 20 for all of those places. The next gift idea would be planners or journals. Now I personally think one of the best places to get these is the dollar store. I, I think I've gotten literally every single one of my planners from the dollar store and they're great. I think the most I paid there is four bucks and sometimes planners can run you up to like 40, 50 dollars, which is crazy. I think this is another one that you'll be seeing on a lot of Christmas lists this year. For some reason, everybody loves planners. I do too, I don't really know why, but there's something so nice about having a planner. Okay, and this is gonna be my last one. I have no clue how many gift ideas I came up with, but I just wanna share with you guys some. But anyways, the last gift idea is a blanket. This one again can be a little bit pricey sometimes, but I'm gonna tell you right now, if you have a Dollarama, go to the blanket section and look for the coral fleece blankets. It's gotta say coral fleece on it. They are such amazing quality, you guys. Honestly, like the best blankets ever. They're four bucks, they're 50 by 60, they're so comfy cozy, they do not shed at all. Like I said, you gotta look for the coral fleece ones, it's gotta say that on it. If it doesn't, don't get them because any other ones from there will shed like crazy. Trust me, I have one. It sheds everywhere and it's been washed like 15 times and it still sheds. But another great option would be Walmart. A lot of the time they have their blankets on sale. I've seen the 50 by 60s for like 20 bucks at Walmart. So you could even go that route as well. It's gonna be a little bit more pricey, but you're definitely gonna get a good blanket out of it. All right guys, so those were all my affordable budget-friendly gift ideas. Like I said at the beginning though, if you cannot afford to get anybody a gift, do not feel bad, do not feel embarrassed or shamed. I think everybody can understand that this year has been super tough. It's been, it's been a year. But anyways, I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to give it a big like and subscribe because I would really appreciate that. Also, don't forget to go check me out on my Instagram. It's always linked down below. And like I said earlier, I'm going to try to link everything, as much as I can anyways, down in the description bar. So definitely if you're looking for any items, check down there. Anyways, I hope you guys have a great day and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys!